In this question, we want to find the coefficient of x cubed, in other words, the x cubed term, if we expand this bracket to the power of 5. Now, the shortcut here is as follows. Now, I want an x cubed. So this term with the x in must be raised to the power of 3 to get an x cubed. However, there's also a 2 here. And the rule here is that this 2 must be raised to the power which adds to make 5. So we've got a power of 3. We also need a power of 2. Because 3 plus 2 is 5. The two powers always add to give the overall power. However, there's also a term from Pascal's triangle. Now, if I draw out Pascal's triangle, and keep on going till I get to the line with a 1, then a 5, because of the power of 5. Now, the term I must times by is given by 5c3. And from Pascal's triangle, we have this one here is 5c0, this is 5c1, this is 5c2, so the number I want is 5c3. If you have a calculator, you can also work out 5c3 quite quickly on that as well. So 5c3 is 10. So this term is 5c3 is 10. Now then, minus 4x to the power of 3. Well, minus 4 to the power of 3 is minus 64. x cubed is just x cubed. And 2 squared is just 4. So the coefficient is 10 times minus 64 times 4. Well, 10 times minus 64 is minus 640. And then I must just times this by 4. And that just gives me minus 2560. So therefore the term is minus 2560x cubed, so the coefficient is just minus 2560. So as a recap, to get the x cubed term required minus 4x to the power of 3. The powers always add to the overall power, so we need a 2 squared. And there's also the Pascal's triangle coefficient, which is given by 5C3.